Hey guys, it's Tam from Tandy. This week I'm going to be doing a review on a few of my Skims products that I own. A bunch of my friends and some people on Instagram have been asking me um, what this stuff is like, so I thought I would just do a review on YouTube. So I'll just show you the packaging. This is the latest one I got. It comes in like this cute little pattern here. And then it says skims on the box there. Shipping took me in Canada. It usually takes around like a week and a half to two weeks to get. Um, I ordered this one around a week and a half ago. And we're in quarantine now. So, so shipping for everything else I've got has been crazy. Like it's taking a month to get to me. So I thought this would take way longer. But it it's exactly the same. So that was kind of nice. It's always so sad to part with these like little packages it comes in it's just so nice okay first up I have this and I apologize I don't remember all the names for all the things or the prices they're just gonna be a ballpark of what they are um, this was the first thing I ever got and this is like a black bodysuit the sculpting bodysuit I believe um, and this is <laughs> I think it's a large this is a large extra large so on the site it says it has all the sizing so it's usually it's pretty accurate 14 just seemed to be kind of hard because it was like size 8 to 14 is this and then size 16 uh, to whatever is a bigger size but then you see the model and she's like so tiny that they show the example for large extra large so it took me a really long time to figure out um, what to get because I did not want to return anything I'm in Canada so returning stuff will be a pain in the ass so yeah I decided to go with the large extra large and it fits perfectly when it came I was horrified because it's I don't know if you can tell in this video but it is really 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 small and eventually you get yourself into it. I thought it would be a lot harder to get into, but it's it's pretty stretchy. But honestly, I haven't tried many other um, shapewear before. So I can't really say if it's the best ever because I've only tried maybe like one or two. But it's definitely hands down the best that I've ever used out of the ones I've tried. This is my favorite piece of all, I'm pretty sure, out of all the things I have. It sucks in so good. Like, it's crazy. But yet, it's so comfortable. You don't feel like it's tight at all. It's really stretchy still while you're wearing it and super, super comfortable. I've never worn anything like that. Um... But yeah, but it holds really, really well. And it also has something on the side that I feel like um, gives you like hips too. So that's really cool. I like wearing this as like a top. So like as a bodysuit with jeans, I like to wear this. And like maybe with a blazer on top, it's really cool. The only thing is it is really thin. So even though this is black you have to wear um, like a nipple cover because it, it will definitely show through not even just like showing your nipples like it you can see your boob through it so so you definitely want to wear a nipple cover while you're wearing it also for peeing going to the washroom is really easy to just like I just pull it to the side I'm not gonna bother taking off the entire thing because um, that would just be crazy it takes like up to five minutes to put on so that that's not happening all right so the next piece I have is basically the same thing I got this in a different order after um, by the way I think that one was $70 US so it it's pretty expensive but cheap compared to um, Spanx although there is a large shipping fee so it ends up being maybe the same this is basically the same thing but I was curious about the ones with the legs that it goes down to like almost your knee so this one originally had that and I tried it on and it was just awful um, not that it looked awful it was just way too much of a pain to put on it was 
so crazy. Like the other one, the bodysuit one only took me like maybe a minute to put on, sometimes a bit longer if I'm struggling, but like it was, this one is insane because you have to get your legs in and it, it was just way too much work. So I tried it on and it held in a little bit. It didn't do enough for me in the legs for me to want to keep it. Also, the problem I had was how am I going to go to the washroom in these as well? There's no way I'm taking this whole thing off and putting it back on somewhere. So I just cut it off. Um, I have my parents own a store and they tailor things. So I'm lucky enough to have them um, cut it and then serge it back for me. Um, so yeah, I just use this as um, a skin colored one that is basically turned into the bodysuit now and I like it. So next we have this guy. I believe this is the core underwear shapewear. That might not be what it's called, but something along those lines. This is one of the purchases I kind of regret because I think just because it's not my size. Um, everything goes on great, it fits great, it holds in great, the only thing is it rolls down. Even though it has this rubber here, um, I don't know, it just always rolls down to the bottom even if I put it like way up here which I saw some people do and like attach it kind of with the bralette which I also have and I tried it still rolled down um, but it wasn't too tight or anything um, but I don't think that it's the quality because I'd seen other people's videos and they were saying how great it was because it didn't roll down so I'm assuming this is just too small um well this is a large extra large and the bodysuit fits me but maybe it's different for the bottoms I'm not sure um so this one I wore one time I don't know I might give it to my mom or something it's just not nice to wear compared to the other things um price wise I think this was $32 US so pretty pretty good price for something like this um but yeah, I just wish it didn't roll and down. And again, I don't know if that's because it's not my size or whatever, but yeah. So next we have my second, I don't know if this is my second favorite or my first. The bodysuit is so, so good. I love it. But this is just, this is the sculpting bra. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what it's called. Um and it's always sold out so I had to do two different orders because last time they didn't have onyx which is black so I got this color and this was the first one I got it's my favorite bra ever like it's I will say for like if you have bigger boobs like me it's it doesn't hold up as much as a normal bra would obviously I'd say that's the only kind of downfall is that they don't look as perky I guess but it's also like a bralette so what are you gonna get um anyway so I looked at the sizes for these and I always go up a size um for bra stuff because I have big boobs so even though on the site it might say like oh size 14 you wear this size whatever I can't trust that so I always go up and I'm glad I did because this fits perfectly so, and this is like a 2x slash 3x which is like on the website I think size 16 to like 20 so that's a lot bigger than I would usually wear but it's so tiny and this one I just got because I like the other one so much I got it in black and it's also same size so small um, I think this was $32 as well and it was well worth it because I it's just so comfy so comfortable and if you're gonna wear it with something like the back I love because if you have like chunks on your back like I do it holds it in so you can't see any of like the fat rolls in the back next I have a few things from the naked collection I think 
I'm really bad at this. Um, I th I'm pretty sure it's the Naked Collection. Um, it's just like soft, uh, super soft material and a, like has bras and underwears. Um, so I got this triangular, so I got this triangle bra and I really, really, really like it. Except I can't, first of all, I, when I got this immediately, I was like, oh, I wish this was a bikini top because it's looks so good as a bikini top. If you have big boobs, I think this is just not for you because even if I went a size bigger, like it fits me perfectly fine, but the triangle thing is just like kind of short. So I think even if I went with a bigger size, it, it wouldn't have been enough. It's, it's just, it goes down too low and then everything kind of just falls out um, sometimes. So like with the other bras, like I'll work out in them, no problem and stuff, but this one you would definitely pop out. Um, so yeah, I do like it. Um, not as comfy as the other ones, but this I got in a 2X, 3X probably. Um, this is, I just got in a 2X. So these ones are just single sizes and yeah, I, it feels really, really nice. You can tell it's like a good quality. Um, but yeah, it's, it's not the best if you're a big breasted and I also have this um, from the same naked line. Um, this one's a full, like, covered one um, in black. This one's probably just 2X as well. Yeah, and I really, really like this one. This one is just for comfort. It's really comfortable. The, the material is just, it's really nice and luxurious feeling. Again, these won't do really anything for your boobs under a shirt, I feel like. It's just, there's no lift. And they're bralettes, so I guess because it kind of fools you in the pictures they have online, it seems like it does lift in the models anyway. It seems like it is lifting, so you would just think that they do, but they don't really. And this was, I believe, also $32 or $34 US. So next I have this, um, I still have the tag on it because I haven't worn it yet, so, but it was $28. This is just a bandeau that um, I've been looking for. I think this is also from the same line, Naked Line. Um, I got this one in a 2X as well and I only have only tried it on so I haven't worn it for a day yet because I wanted to kind of save it for summer and wear with some of my strapless tops so I could wear this with it. Um, I will say I would go a size bigger. It does fit, but it was, when I tried it on, it does kind of leave like a, the band is tight, so it will stay on, it won't fall off, but then it kind of like pokes in, you know, when you have the little flab here that falls out. Maybe that's just me, I don't know. Other than that, it feels really nice. Um, it was hard to get on because it's kind of like, because it is like a tight fit, but it was really, really difficult to get on. Like I had to put it on multiple ways to try and get it on because every time I put it on, it would roll another way. And the one time I put it on backwards, or sorry, upside down because it flipped while I was under there. And one time it was inside out because it flipped. So it's, it's a little bit of work. I will have to try it with something, but so far I honestly would say if like I could have gone to a store and turned it, I would. Last I have underwears. I have three of them. So the first one I got is from the Naked line. Um, I got it in an extra large because usually I wear large and all of these sizing is difficult so I got um, a size up just in case because again in the photos. <laughs> They show, like, you can see your sizes on the people, but then, like, some of them, three of the sizes, it's like you go to 1X, and then, or it's like you go to 2X, and then it's this girl, and then you go up to 5X, and then it's the same girl. So I'm like, I'm not really sure about that. Um, but anyways, I got this underwear, I think it's the boy short. And it is the best underwear I have ever 
worn in my entire life. I really wanted to get more but it's just it's not on the site anymore right now so I don't know if they're out of stock or whatever but they are they were not cheap but like I do not regret a single cent and I would pay again they're just they stretch so far and then the material is just really really soft and silky basically why I love it so much is because it feels like you're not wearing anything like literally I forget that I'm wearing underwear when I'm wearing this and sometimes this happens to me like when I'm wearing a high underwear it'll just like roll down to the bottom and then I'm like oh I can feel it it's like it's rolled down sometimes when I'm wearing this sometimes it feels like it's rolled down I'm like oh man and then I I go to pull it up and it's still up here so it just feels like literally naked naked line feels like you're naked so last is I have these pair of thongs um, I honestly only tried them out because I was on the site looking for the naked underwear but they were all gone in the thongs everything or they just didn't have my size so I saw these other ones um, these other thongs that were in the smooth essentials line and at the model I can tell I can usually tell if the thong is gonna be good for me when I see it on someone I can see if it covers or if it's you know really thin in the back or short which is I can't wear I can't wear like super short thongs so it looked really nice on the models um, so I wasn't really sure about it because it's not the same material as the other one but I went with it anyway and they are doesn't say the price but I'm pretty sure they were like $28 and then I didn't buy them and then I went back the next day and they were like two for 28 or so. so I was like that's a sign I have to buy them now so anyways um, it's weird because they look so big they are big so when I opened it um, first of all I got a 2x they showed the girl in the extra large and she was like tiny so I was like it's hard to trust these pictures but I was like she looks so small and then the 2x and up was the same girl but she was like smaller than me still so I was like okay so I should probably go up two sizes just in case um so then I opened the box and I was like oh no like it's really really big like it looks ginormous and really freaking long but I tried them on they fit perfectly and they're so amazing they just hold everything in exactly where you want it to it's the perfect length it looks so long like way too long but it's not long at all and it has like um this little rubber here so it won't fall down and it just sticks to you like really nicely and i really liked it and i got another one in black so i'm really happy that i got two so i am really curious to try more underwear because they're just freaking amazing and like they are way more than i would spend at any other place i usually buy underwear at airy for like 10 for 30 bucks so this was like crazy for me but honestly so so worth it so i also got this top here this is um from the cotton collection and i honestly just threw it in because the shipping is so much that I'm like there's no point in just getting two things I might as well just throw something else that's kind of cheaper in there so this is 32 bucks from the cotton collection I really like the color um, I liked this one and the purple one it's it's really cute um, it's short like it's quite like it's quite short um, but I guess it's just for at home or like you could wear it out too um, but honestly very plain like if you're just gonna buy stuff from the cotton collection like this and like Boxers, I would definitely not recommend it because it I could get this for 20 bucks somewhere or less So that being said like I like the color it feels just like a regular cotton tank top Like maybe a little bit better, but I also haven't this is the first time wearing it So I don't know how well it's gonna do in the long run. Maybe it's good quality. But yeah, so anyways guys I hope you enjoyed my review and I know it wasn't too thorough I wanted to get through everything um, and kind of not take too long on them so if you do have any questions for me just let me know in the comment section and I'll answer them for you that's it for this week guys we'll see you next time
Bye.